Welcome to paradise. We are on a new claim. We tested down at the bottom of this area where it flattens out a bit. And we found some flakes of gold, fine gold. So we thought we'd continue farther up. We have about three kilometers of this creek staked. And today, I thought we would check this area out. Lift some of these rocks up, see if we can find some gold. Loads of quartz veins on this property. Right here, you have quartz running through your host rock. You got quartz over there. Quartz veins here. So we're gonna do a bunch of sampling, sample panning, also rock chip samples, maybe some grab samples if we find anything. Nice big veins running along there, of course. There's a look at the quartz veins over there. You can see some oxidization on them, which Gives you your indication of iron. My prospecting partner is down there and he is going to fill up the first pan. So my prospecting partner is digging a hole, getting some material there. Decided to check out some of the rocks in the area. So here you have a very chloritized rock, slightly schistose, and here you can see oxidization and some pyrotization. So just in the last few minutes I've noticed pretty heavy pyritization in some of the rocks. Lots of disseminated pyrite and calcopyrite. That's very fine grained. So here you have a fine grained lithic crystal tuff. Uh, there's some slight argolites in there. But uh, a lot of these rocks are basaltic and uh, and acidic and it looks like there's pretty heavy chloritization in a lot of them like these ones over here so the kind of geology we're looking at here is typical for something you'd see in like a polymetallic massive sulfide deposit so we're in the right area geology is good we know there's gold here hopefully we find some deposits we're going to spend most of the uh, month of December and into January on this property. So we'll see what we can find. First pans are good.
few micro dots in there that's about it so we're moving on didn't find a whole lot there did about 10 pans and the most we got was three or four specs so we'll keep going I think this is going to be a lot easier to work come the summertime. What do you think? I think we should test right there. So we are on an inside bend here. We're gonna pull some material from along this area here and hopefully get a bit more gold than the last spot. One speck. Loads of rocks here with pyrotization. They're just everywhere, but not finding a lot of gold in this area. So we veered off course a little bit. We're off the creek onto the main road in a quarry. You got some nice crystallization of quartz here. I don't know if you can see here. You have tiny specks of fine AU in your rusty material. Very, very fine. Lots of quartz here with very fine looking gold. We're going to take a couple of these pieces for an analysis. So you have a ton of quartz veins, but nothing crazy for mineralization. You can see the rusty patches here, sort of vein-like. Any gold that we can see is running with fractures like that and it looks very finely disseminated we're going to take a sample nonetheless probably not going to be anything crazy for grade we can barely see it on the jeweler's loop so we will see back on the creek as you can see we have a fork so this one right here 
I believe comes from a lake. This one right here comes from the headwaters of a mountain where there's a known gold deposit, gold and copper. This one, I think it's kind of the same deal. Uh, there's deposits along the creek, so you should be able to find gold in both of these. So I think we'll test along the side here where we can. But while I'm waiting for my prospecting partner, I might as well text my wife. If you guys don't have one of these, you should get one. Satellite, GPS, messenger, pretty awesome. I've noticed a lot of the rocks have changed. You have granite, granodiorite, you got a lot of porphyritic rocks here. So bedrock geology looks like it's changed within the last few hundred meters. more black sand but I don't see any gold or minimal minimal specs we moved up above the area where the two creeks converge and we're gonna pan here along the banks there's a small gravel bar behind me. There's another one over here. Yeah, finally. I just saw a nice little line of gold right in there. There's about four or five pieces. Right there. Sweet.
We've got some decent gold in there. Oh yeah. There we go. That's the pan we've been looking for all day. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed. That's all for today. We're gonna run out of daylight if we stay here any longer. We've got the spot GPS. So we'll be back here for sure. Hope you guys enjoyed. And hope you guys enjoyed some gold. I know we finally did. <laughs>